I was just watching a video, a Quartis video, East Meets West. And it was very interesting because, and you know, take your hat off before dinner as opposed to put your hat on before dinner. It was very well done and very sweet. Uh, so someone sent me an email, said you got to see this guy's video, this East Meets West video, because how horrible it is. So I watched it and I saw what it was he was talking about. Now, Querty and I are, are good friends. I agree with most of that video, except for when we get down to the end. The one, I guess the one comparison that really got me, that, I, that, that struck a chord in my brain, was that, that uh, um, Western culture didn't love their kids as much um, and didn't love their families as much. You can find Americans that will fit the East meets West video perfectly and fulfill all of the stereotypes that were mentioned in the video. But you'll also meet millions of Americans who don't fit that stereotype at all. Hat off before dinner, I agree. I want to get rid of my kids, I don't agree. My family comes first. I love my children. I would gladly give my life for my wife or my children at any moment. They're my top priority in my life. I'm not a drinker, I'm not a drug taker, I'm not a wife swapper. I'm an American and there are millions like me. I'm getting the feeling that even among really good people on both sides of the East and West, that we think we're the normal ones and they're sick. They're sick over there. They're perverted. They're wrong. The reality is that East meets West is East is an apple and West is an orange. Is an apple better than an orange? They're different. But the comparison I keep hearing everybody make is we're an apple and they are a piece of crap. They're nothing, they're garbage. And they need to wisen up and become an apple like us. That's not what it is. We're humans over here. I'm an American and I'm not alone. I'm standing with a lot of other Americans who love you, who are not perverts and not sickos and not haters. I don't even watch television. And the television I used to watch, uh, I know what goes on, on TV because I'm on the internet. Which, which my wife says is just like watching TV because there's watch YouTube, so maybe I do watch television. I watch the YouTube. That isn't our world. Would you like us Americans to judge all Easterners, Middle Easterners, Muslims, and Arabs by what we watch on television? No. We wouldn't like you to judge us by what you see on television either. At least I wouldn't like you to. Common ground is where we meet in the middle. My common ground for me is my culture meets your culture. And all the areas where they don't clash, if, as long as your culture doesn't try to crush my culture and my culture doesn't try to crush your culture, where we meet is common ground. And that's the area where we can love each other and enjoy our differences and celebrate our differences without trying to force the other to conform to what, it, what our world is. We can love each other and we can feel safe and we can become friends. But understand, East isn't better than West. West isn't better than East. Believe it. I know it in my heart. Search yourself. Search your soul. You'll know it's true too.